This is a quick walkthrough for Fine Calculator running on sentencing guidelines for Android. Just before we go into um, the Fine Calculator, just touch on the preferences. Within preferences, we can set specific options for the Fine Calculator, such as the default costs we expect in our sort of courts. So these are based on what I see in, uh, in, in most adult courts, 60, 85, 105, 105, and you can change those. We also include the relevant weekly income, which is currently £400 for employed and £110 for on benefit. Some benches have a very specific type of rounding, uh, therefore you can disable rounding on the fine calculator uh, if, uh, if required for your particular bench. So that's really a choice for your local practice. Just while we're looking at preferences, just to uh, cover what else we have, you can configure which preferred index uh, sorting you have, so A to Z, all the way through to by group. You can also change your default pronouncements. So if you're sitting in family court, you could change both of these to family and bench books to family. So those are the preferences. Now we, we'll just click off preferences and go into Fine Calc. And this begins to highlight an issue using some of the smaller Android devices when we have the device in landscape format. And you can see it's actually quite difficult to use. So uh, we sort of recommend or suggest you switch into portrait mode when you're planning to use the fine calculator. just makes it a lot easier. So with the fine calculator back in portrait mode, we can see we've got uh, a set of upper limit but, uh, labels, which are just for reference. Uh, check those against your offence guideline, which will give you the highest level for that particular offence. We've got fine bands A through to E. You're probably using A, B, and C most of the time. We can have a specific percentage discount or just use these buttons for a third off through to not guilty for non-attenders in motoring. We give you the 110 button <coughs> for assumed weekly uh, income for benefits and also 400 for assumed employed. And we can also enter a weekly salary. So for example, if we had salary of 490, that will recalculate that A-band fine based on that new weekly salary. And correspondingly, we can have a monthly salary. So if I had, for instance, 4,900 per month, that gives me a band A fine of 565, band B, which is 100% of income, per week, 1,130, and band C, and so on. So let's just go back to uh, standard 400. We can select <coughs> a, a court costs from those buttons that you can configure through preferences. And in this case, we've assumed we're dealing with the offences after the 1st of uh, December. So adding this fine will give us a victim surcharge of £40, that's 10% of 400 So this is a multiple fine calculator, so we could add another fine, say a band A, and add fine, that puts it into here. Let's just reset the fine calculator, just, just so you can see it. We have the totals listed at the bottom of the fine calculator. Let's just do a reset of the fine calculator and just show you how we use this slider to adjust uh, a fine level given. So still based on, say, £400 per week on a B-band fine, for example, speeding. And if that fine was, that, that uh, offence had some mitigation, you could, could reduce down to 90% or increase, aggravate to a different percentage. And that adjusts the fine after plea into the fine calculator. 
That's a quick run through the Fine Calculator in Census Guidelines for Android.